Hey gamers, Maniac here with GamingSense.net, back. Sorry for uh, for the hat all of a sudden. I have really weird static shock hair right now, so I figured put this hat on. It looked better. I kind of feel like Snow from Final Fantasy XIII, but maybe that's just me. So let's talk about why we're here. You guys know if you've been on this YouTube channel, many of you may have found this YouTube channel because of my love of balls. No, that's not a euphemism. I love balls. That is B-A-W-L-S, of course. Balls Soda. And earlier last week, Balls announced that they have just released an all-new flavor. This was a huge announcement. This is their first flavor in quite a while. First new flavor in quite a while. And so, Balls decided that their next flavor was going to be Balls Ginger. I love all different types of sodas. I love root beer. I love orange soda. And I love ginger ale also. So this is the first time I'm ever going to have a caffeinated ginger ale. I don't think there's anybody who ever made a caffeinated ginger ale. Most of the ginger ales that I found here that are available, whether it be Canada Dry or anything like that, doesn't have caffeine. However, there are two really good reasons why they chose to make ginger ale at this time. As far as I know, there are no non-caffeinated I'm sorry, there are no caffeinated ginger ales out there, but particularly because it's a very old gamer's trick that ginger is a good treatment for motion sickness. Whether it be seasickness or motion sickness, for at least a decade, people have been telling me that ginger is a good treatment for motion sickness. Now, what's been going on in the last year? The complete takeover of virtual reality. This beverage could be the perfect combination for people interested in VR Let's say we try this finally. I have been looking forward to this for like a week now. It's a great bottle. I love the color. It's in the traditional Balls bottle. It's got a nice little tinted metallic green cap, which says Balls Ginger on it with the website balls.com. Um, I don't see, I don't see a caffeine content. It just says product contains high levels of caffeine. Down the hatch. Let's see. Well, that's good. I'm starting to feel the caffeine almost immediately on this. I, it tastes like ginger ale. It tastes exactly like ginger ale. I dare say, if you, I mean, obviously, if you like ginger ale, definitely pick this up. If you want high caffeinated beverages. And you like ginger ale, definitely, oh, i got to recommend this. It's, it's ginger ale. It tastes like ginger ale. Maybe a little sweeter. There might be, it, it, it does taste a little sweeter than some of the other ginger ales that I've had. Uh, maybe that's because this has a lot of sugar in it. This has, at least for 10 ounces, according to this, it says it has 30 milligrams of sodium. And as for sugar, it's 31 grams of sugar. So, about as much as a can of Pepsi would have, I would imagine, the sugar, the sugar content, but um, let's try again. Yeah, yeah, that's ginger ale, all right. That is definitely ginger ale. It's a good ginger ale, too. It's really good. All right, guys. If you like ginger ale, you like high caffeinated beverages, you like balls, definitely check this stuff out. It's worth the purchase. I'd like to thank Balls for sending me the case of this stuff, so I'm really excited about that. You can probably find it right now. If you can't find it in stores at this point, you can probably find it on Balls' website, shop.balls.com. Take care, everybody. We'll be drinking some of this stuff as I play Final Fantasy X later this week. So. Until next time, guys, my name is Maniac with GamingSS.net. Over and out.